I wanted to just juxtapose what Sinuji said and what uh, uh, Shazia ji said, because if you notice the common running theme was that this is meant to be an abstraction. It's an identity that encompasses everything and doesn't force you to choose. It doesn't make you make those choices. It doesn't force binaries onto you. And yet what you find is what Abhinav brought in, which was modernity. And it's this modern ideas of certain things that are forcing you to choose. Why do you have to choose? Mm -hmm. And I think that's where we bring in Gopi, who has refused to confuse sex and gender. And why don't you give us your thoughts on this subject? Um, being a Hindutva person means going beyond identities for me. Okay. Being a Hindutva person means respect for all forms of life for me. Being a Hindutva person means I come from a land uh, which is not just about it is it's narcissistic uh, or uh, there is, because it is about a very kind of uh, indigenousness where we venerate, uh, as Sinuji said, uh, the you know the selfless ancestors, God as mother. In our theological perspectives, God is mother. I mean, no one should want to kneel in front of a masculine figure. I am wearing a Jewish Hebrew ring which says "Ebaume Chichina" in 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 Jewish aspect. About, uh, about God says, above me is Chichena, which means, Chichena means feminine aspect of God. Mm. Uh, Jewish traditions rooted from Kabbalistic values, and even before them had Zoroastrianism. Mm. So it is about, what to say, venerating the divine feminine, and for me it is like being an intersex person refers to my sex identity, being a genderqueer refers to my gender identity, being a Gay refers to my sexual orientation, but all this refers to one aspect of my life, but it's not all about my life. That's what Hindutva taught to me. Mm. And, you know, this is the land in south of Tamil Nadu. We have mm. Kutandava temple mm. in Vilupuram. Mm. A lot of, because in this millennium, a lot of temples were destroyed in northern, northern part of India, but still we protect some of these traditions and temples in south of India, down south. This Kutandava temple, every year, at least 700,000 indigenous gender variant people, we call them in the name of Hijras, Mangalmukis, Jogapas, Kinners, uh, Nupi Manbis, a lot of name for them. This is a god and goddess, which is specifically dedicated to my gender, where I perform the ritual. The priest need not should be a Brahmin or something, necessarily Brahmin. I mean, these are the traditions which you can only see in this land, where I need to protect the integrity of my community. See, every temples here are established with a sanskar, to protect the sanskar for each men and women, the temples, most of the cities are formed around the temples. I hail from Madurai. Madurai is ruled by Meenakshi, our eternal queen, because I'm so attached to her, who born with a three-breast queer uh, queen of Madurai. She, where, what to say, the whole city is developed around mm -hmm. these temples. Even this Hindutva, I mean, the Hindu philosophy gives space for people like you know, uh, who bond uh, in different gender identities, with different sexual orientation, mm -hmm. with different sex identities are accommodated under this. So that's what Hindutva is all about for me personally. Right. 